Those who favor our plan to alter the river, raise your hand. Thank you for your vote. Last week, you'll recall, I spoke about how water never complains, how it runs where we tell it, seemingly at home, flooding grain or pinched by geometric banks like those in this graphic depiction of our plan. We ask for power. A river falls or boils to turn our turbines. The river approves our plan to alter the river. Due to a shipwreck downstream, I'm sad to report our project is not on schedule. The boat was carrying cement for our concrete rip-rap bulestrade that will force the river to run east of the factory site through the state-owned grove of cedar. Then the uncooperative carpenters' union went on strike. When we get that settled and the concrete, given good weather, we can go ahead with our plan to alter the river. We have the injunction. We silence the opposition. The workers are back, the materials arrived, and everything's humming. I thank you for this award, this handsome plaque I'll keep forever above my mantle, and I'll read the inscription often aloud to remind me how, with your courageous backing, I fought our battle and won. I'll always remember this banquet, this day we started to alter the river. Flowers on the bank, a park on Forgotten Island, Return of cedar and salmon. Who are these men? These Johnnies come lately with plans to alter the river. What's this wild festival in May celebrating the runoff? Display floats on fire at night and a forest dance under the stars. Children sing through my locked door, old stranger. We're going to alter, to alter, alter the river. Just when the water was settled and at home, Thank you very much. Thank you. Oh, you're you're very dear. I'm going to come back. <laughs> Thank you.